Hi campers, it's Miss Mackenzie here. Today we are going to learn how to make these really cool recycled owls that you can hang outside. How sweet is that? You guys ready to get started? Let's get started. So the first thing that you can decide is, do you want the CD to be facing this way or this way? So you got a nice little reflection. Since this one's like this, I'm actually going to do it on this side now. In your bag, you have a lot of different options of what supplies you have. Now, my bag might be a little bit more full than yours. It's okay, everybody has different supplies and that's what makes it so exciting. I'm first going to start by putting everything on here where I want everything to go. So for the wings, I think I want wings like that. And if you look, there's already pre-drilled holes, which is awesome, because then you can just kind of place them in there. Now, mine, they have little openings. Yours might not, that's okay. But since mine does, I think I'm going to push it in a little bit more so the wing goes out, then in. Kind of like that. Yeah, I like that, yeah. And just play around with it and see how you like yours to look. I like that. I'm gonna put those there. Okay, I think I am ready to start assembling. I'm gonna start assembling the wings first because if you do the eyes first, uh-oh, can't see that hole right there. So we're going to assemble the wings first. So I think how I'm going to do this is I'm going to figure out a way to put these wings together, kind of loop them together. This might be a little bit tricky and if this is confusing for you, you do not have to do something like this. Be as creative as you want. Don't feel like you need to follow exactly what I'm doing. This is just what I thought would be cool with the supplies that I have. So I'm gonna take this wire. So I have this really fun wire right here and you can easily cut this with scissors. Put the wire through this and then put the wire through one of these holes. Okay, so now we have this. Now you can make it so the wings go up and down and move, or you can kind of just wrap the wire around so it stays in place. That is up to you. That's the fun thing about doing recycled art. It's going to be so unique and so different from what anybody else is making. Okay, we have our next wing. So this is still moving, that's okay. If you want it to stay solid, we can potentially get it to stay in one place. You can work with it. Now I'm going to take this one and put it through. Ooh, I like that. It's turning out pretty cool if you ask me. All right. Last wing on this side. I'm going to go down here a little bit. Yep. And kind of bring the wire through. And now what I'm doing, look at this, we're gonna go up, we're gonna go over a wing, and then under the next wing. Over, then we're gonna go around. So now it's going underneath, up, over this, and under that. That just makes it so it's a little bit sturdier. Make sure you don't use too much of this wire because we still need to do it on another side. So just remember that, keep that in mind. We can always go through um, an eye or just another hole to kind of finish it because we need to tie this off. That's very, very important. And I might do here, might put it under that and just kind of wrap that around a couple times and that'll probably keep it nice and tied off. Da 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 da, perfect. Oh, that looks so cool. And I'm gonna do the exact same, well first I'm gonna cut it. And I'm going to do the exact same thing on the other side. And da 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 da, beautiful wings, look at that. And now you can take a little pause here and try to make your own wings, or you can keep going with the rest of the video. Completely up to you. Now let's do the eyes. All you have to do is put those on and then we have these cool little screws. So you just kind of take those off and you just put them through here and then put them in there, see? And then take that, take this little washer and just screw it on. Easy peasy. Now let's do it with the other side. So unscrew this and you take this 
You put the screw through that, and then you put it through the Gatorade lid, or whatever kind of lid you have, and then you put it through the eye hole, and then you screw that on. You might need somebody to help you hold it if you're having trouble. All right, and there we go. And here is another potential pause break. You can pause here and work on the eyes, or you can just keep moving on with the video. The next section is how to assemble the beak. And I think the easiest way to do this would be I'm gonna make a little loop and stick both of these through the same hole. So I'm gonna kind of just push that in there. And I'm gonna do that with, with the bottom as well. I think it's easier if you go and you just push one through, you push one through, and then you push other one through. Yeah, perfect. So we have these two little loops to hold this. I don't like the this part, so I'm just gonna, there we go. You can have a little hook on his nose. I like that. And we made these two little loops. I'm just gonna stick through the two little loops. And I'm gonna flip it backwards and twist, twist, twist. So I'm keeping them kind of open like this, and then I'm just twisting, kind of like what you do with, um bread ties when you're closing up your bread. Pulling this to make it a little bit tighter and twist, twist, twist. Okay, I got that. And look, awesome. I love it. <laughs> now what do I wanna do? I think what something I wanna do is I wanna put a little hook on the top. So I'm gonna take this and put it through one of these holes and put it through another hole. I'm gonna take this and I'm gonna twist this on the back gonna twist that on the top and look has a little hook now so I can hang it outside if I want to um, and you could also make feet if you want to you could take these and turn them into feet or you could find some feet but you know what I like this just like that I think this is fun so there you go happy creating guys <laughs>